Police in the Tarrant County city of Lake Worth seized more than $2 million in drugs. They also uncovered illegal high-powered weapons. Fox Wars' Dion Anglin joins us from Lake Worth. Dion. Hi there, Clarice. Well, one arrest and an alarming amount of drugs. A police chief here says that it is record-setting for this department, but would be significant in a city of any size. And it is the largest illicit pharmaceutical seizure in our department's history. Lake Worth police arrested 43-year-old John Curb. He faces multiple illegal drugs and weapons charges. Curb was inside this home on Lakeside Drive. Police had a warrant for his arrest based on tips and multiple overdose calls connected to the address. We gained entry very, fairly quickly. Once we got in, he was resistive. Um, he didn't actively fight. He just wasn't obeying commands. Investigators say the arrest was just the beginning. The most significant seizure was amphetamine, uh, or more commonly known as Adderall. Uh, detectives seized 3,390 grams of suspected amphetamine. That's 3.39 kilograms of amphetamine. They also seized 18.6 grams of suspected fentanyl powder, and that number may seem small, uh, but that's enough doses to kill 9,300 people. Uh, that's more than the population of our entire city. Police showed off more results from the bust. 11 high-powered illegal guns, including silencers. Also, a pill press machine, along with an alarming street value of $2.3 million worth of dope. They also see 17 grams of DMT, 54 grams of suspected bath salts, 24 grams of suspected cocaine, 186 grams of suspected promethazine syrup, 20 grams of homemade alprazolam or Xanax, and then 42 grams of suspected methamphetamine. Police say neighbors often reported constant traffic in and out of the house, along with other suspicious activity. Could not step in this house without stepping on a meth pop. Uh, paraphernalia, empty baggies. I've, I've been doing this for a little bit, and uh, it was in every room of this house, in every nook and cranny, everywhere you looked, there was narcotics and paraphernalia. Police say the case is under review by federal authorities, a case that totals, according to the Lake Worth chief, enough drugs to kill more than 11,000 people. The most significant thing to me is when I think about these 11,721 lethal doses. Um, those are lives lost, families destroyed. And so, it, and then, you know, beyond that, you think about these weapons in the wrong hands. Now, police expect the case will be picked up by federal authorities. And Curb, meantime, he is behind bars at the Tarrant County Jail with bond set at $50,000.